Yo, Vaisant here. So Disney is coming to Cookie Run Kingdom. And we do have a video here that I probably just want to watch first. And then we can go over the news in the game. It's pretty much like a first reaction for like both of these. So bear with me here. Uh, so let's start with this. Just look above at the night sky. Festival of Dreams and Wishes. And all. Once upon a time, there was a cookie who wished upon... Oh, is that the cream, cream unicorn? And their earnest wish was granted. The witch of dreams. Whoa. For them this is the new gotcha, right? Never ending tale full of adventures. I, 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 I knew they had their own gotcha. Like, why are people complaining about their diamonds when I knew it's going to be like the Sonic event where they have their own currency to do the gotcha stuff? It's all cookies. The Cinderella? Okay, okay. Or, oh, Mickey. Oh, okay. I thought it was the clock thing had to do with Cinderella. <laughs> Did I hear something about a festival? Because that sounds fun. Awesome. Damn, voice acting too? Nice, Why, nice. It's like a dream. A wonderful dream come true. Thank you for letting me be part of your world. Oh, the new uh, decorations. Am I dreaming? Ooh. The Summer Nights Festival, Cookie Run Kingdom. Wow, I like how, I like the effects that they're using. I get like the magical Disney thing. Okay. I wonder what the like battle events and stuff's gonna be. Who that? Oh, Beauty and the Beast. A. Eh? Snow White. Oh, they even have the I don't I don't remember the the ducks names, but damn. Okay, let's go into the game and check it out. I have it just open. I haven't really read it or anything. So, so there are gonna be a fixes and adjustment to improve the. Oh, I'm hoping to have the production window, please, where they have lists of everything, uh, production wise. You know, I'll turn on the sound for this. Hoping, hoping that you can just. The all your production and then just build them all in that window. Unfortunately, the update may change before release. Okay. So, okay. Cookie Run Kingdom X Disney Crossover Festival of Dreams and Wishes. It starts on July 7th. I'm assuming it's 27. They just forgot a two here. <laughs> okay. So, Cream Unicorn made a wish, right? Never ending story. Hey. Friends are about to visit the Cookie Kingdom. Disney themed decors and Cookie Castle design. Oh, I might want to change the cook Cookie Castle. Meet the new decor theme, World of Magic and Dreams. You can obtain the new Disney themed decor through the Disney Crossover Gacha and Wishing Star Shop. So I, I, I was sure that it was going to have their own gacha for sure. Like, all the, like the Sonic event. I knew it. People were complaining about their diamonds, but yeah. I wanted to say something, but everyone was talking about being broke. I'm like, I'm pretty sure there was a, another own gotcha and own currency. I did comment some of them. Anyways, take part in various events and complete missions to earn wishing star crystals to use in the gotcha. Searching the cores from the new theme can produce wishing star. Okay, so they're gonna have the own decor that can produce the currency which you can use to pull. You'll be able to obtain new cookie design. Cookie Castle design through the Land of Dreams event. Okay, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what the event's gonna foretold. All right, so there's the guest rarity. So they add a new rarity, and I'm pretty sure these are gonna be permanent. It's just that you can't use them, right? Okay, you can't use them in production activities and battles, nor they can be upgraded. But they're just there for your looks, and then they just be wandering around. <laughs> uh, Disney. Cookies will not appear in the cookie gotcha, but they have their own gotcha. Right, right. Disney cookies will not appear on a regular cookie list. You will meet them in the Palace Dream lobby instead. Okay, so they don't show up in this, but they'll show up in the, the lobby. You'll be able to access cookie lobby through the Palace of Dream even though the event is over. So they may sure it's permanent. Okay, so Mickey, Minnie, Daisy Duck, that was the name. Donald Duck, Goofy. 
Alice. Oh, Alice from Alice Wonderland. Lilo and Stitch. Peter Pan, Tinkerbell. Aladdin, Jasmine, Belle, Beauty and the Beast, so pretty much. Cinderella, Mulan, Pocahontas. Hey, I was not expecting that. Princess Aurora, Snow White, and Ariel. Ariel can step on both ground and water. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm nice. Nice. They pay attention to detail. Attain new Disney. I know people were talking about Tiana, right? I don't even know who she is, to be honest. So they pretty much stuck with like the OG. OG cookies. Or OG Disney. Like back when I was younger. Kind of thing. Though Lilo and Stitch is like probably like the borderline. Anyways. So complete the tutorial of Land of Dream Wishes to access the crossover, take part in various events and complete missions. Wishing Star Shop. Uh, fragments for co Disney cookies and decor that you don't have in the Wishing Star Shop. Okay. Okay, let's check the events. Complete missions and com collect stamps to earn rewards. Gather a certain amount of stamps to unlock limited edition cookie castle design. That's what I kind of want. Gather all stamps to be able to receive one ancient or legendary cookie. Damn, you just get it's a selectable. Nice, nice. I don't know. Not of the cookies right now, legendary or ancient aren't really meta, but I would say Dark Cacao, Sea Fairy, Frost Queen, probably decent ones. Pure vanilla not being used, Holly Berry, you'd rather use wild berries, so I don't know. <laughs> Play daily during Disney crossover and receive rewards. Twinkle Twinkle wishing star missions. Okay, so they have missions, like daily missions or whatever. Typical event quests. <laughs> Photo with Disney cookie. Obtain Disney cookie and decor to complete collection. Unravel the special Disney cookie stories. Okay, so they're gonna have a story intertwined. You can see the interaction. All right, so cream unicorn. The isolated amusement park lies in darkness, light flickers, the merry go round begins, rotate, the park magically returns to life as a long pony embraces the piers of rainbows. After floating among the attractions, a graceful landing on top of the ferris wheel, in the end all shines of memories and stars. Oh, they didn't go over the skills, okay. <laughs> Alright, so we have new functions and improvement. Undo buttons and redo buttons, nice. You can now be able to undo redo if you want to revert changes. Okay, okay. Swap into cores. Oh, you can swap them now instead of having to like move them out and then move them in. <laughs> okay, cool. Purchasing multiple decor at once. Select the decor in the decor shop and use buy several button. To prevent accident, decor purchases with crystals can be only bought or what? Okay. Toggling ground and changes for all cookie houses. Oh, so you can do it all at once now. Nice. Cause I usually, sometimes I remove, most of the time I remove them. The core quality and purchasing with layout editor. I don't use the layout editor too much, but selecting the decor in the layout editor will allow you to see the quantity at your disposal. When number changes to zero, you will be offered to purchase more. Layout res 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 restoration <laughs> upon abnormal exit. Okay, so if you somehow crash or whatever, it will just revert or allow you to, to save the changes that you did before you saved it. Other improvements. All right, here we go. Able to store the cores upon if they're currently occupied by cookies. Color buy of the buy button is changed. Okay, tap and hold the core to enter the layout editor. You will be able to purchase several buildings in a row, including cookie houses. Please know that only cookie houses of the same design and level can be placed in a row. Ah, damn, they don't. So they don't have the production thing yet. You're able to use the new button to see in the shop. Cookie houses will be displayed with the current design. Apply various in-game images and clips. Button layout automatically adjusts to display buttons when you interact with them. Okay, so it's automatically display. Improved rewards. So they now give more star jellies. A lot of pretty much just star jellies everywhere. More star jellies in general, and then some coins. Some other items with war exploration. But all right, pretty good, pretty good. I'm pretty excited to see what the event kind of foretodes. It's just extra things to do, right? So, ho what are you guys looking forward to? What cookies are you hoping to get in a guest gotcha? I'll probably have like cool videos like usual and like shorts or whatever. So make sure to subscribe. 
And I'll see you guys next time. All right. Later days.